What up guys, I'm the World of Wrecking Ball, back here with another video, and today is a very special day. <clears throat> Listen, I know, I missed out on making a video on Friday the 13th, that's a mistake on my part, but I'm going to make it up to you guys, not by ranking Jason masks, but by ranking Michael Myers. Yes, that's what we're going to be doing today. And... What am I doing? Alright, so anyways. There's a, a lot of masks in the series. So I'm going to back up because I'm going to insert some images. Coming in last place. Should come in... No, no, no surprise. The CGI mask from Halloween H2O, baby. So, where do I even begin? This mask is trash. Actual trash. Basically what happened, they wanted Michael Myers looking at the, uh, get, uh, this summer camp or college student, whatever, I can't remember, but, uh, just looking at him for one scene, but they were too lazy to make a mask for it, so all they did was put CGI on it, it's just trash, second mask, um, alright, just, just for future reference, I'm not gonna be putting in any of the Rob Zombie, um, you know, paper mache masks, so. Next up on the list is <clears throat> the KMB mask from Halloween H2O. There's just not much to say about this mask, so I don't know. So just moving on, this will be the Halloween 2 mask. No, 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 stop with the tomatoes, okay? Not the original Halloween 2, Rob Zombie Halloween 2, that mask. Yeah. It's, I don't like it the way, like, the whole, like, right side of his eye, and then you only see the left side of his Face is covered. I just, I don't get it. Just doesn't look right to me. Coming in next is the Halloween three season of the witch masks, and I'm grouping all three of them together. Now, my problem is, I would have loved this movie. If it was just like a regular, you know, if they would have just titled it Season of the Witch and just not connected it to the Halloween franchise, I would adore this movie because this is a great movie. And the masks, to be honest, they just look like some Dollar Tree bought masks. I'm just saying. I believe I have some. Masks, hold on. Um, okay, uh, I can't find them at the moment, but maybe I'll find them later. Um, all right, next on the list. Oh, and by the way, I'm also not putting in the pink mask from Halloween 4, so yeah. Coming in next. The freaking Halloween 5 mask. Ah! I don't even want to talk about this mask. Tom Shanks himself is pretty good. He's a pretty good Michael Myers actor. But that freaking alien mask. It's just trash. But... 
next on the list is put your hands together for the Rob Zombie Halloween mask. I just, it, uh, it's actually a pretty good mask. From here on out, it's good masks. Like, good to great. So, um, I do like, like the rotting away aesthetic of it. It's a pretty cool thing, actually. So, yeah. Next on the list, excuse me, Halloween 2, the original Halloween 2. It's the original as the same Halloween, but yet so different because Dick Warlock is wearing the mask. And his whole shape and physicality is different than Nick Castle's. So it stretches out, and plus it was under Deborah Hill's bed for like three years and she's a heavy smoker so the paint got worn away and yeah so coming in next on the list now this might be a controversial pick uh, because I haven't seen any other youtuber put this on their ranking I'm gonna include the blood tears mask from Halloween 2 now let me get up real quick so I can get something. I know this is unprofessional, but I need to show you guys something. Hola. I actually do have the, uh, whoa there, pal. I have the Trick or Treat Studios Blood Tears mask. I love it. I actually love this mask. It's a great Michael Myers mask. Okay. Coming in next on the ranking, bud, is the Halloween H2O mask, the Stan Winston one. Now, Okay, excuse me, hold on. The Halloween 6 mix mask. Then is the Halloween H2O Stan Winston mask. It's just a beautiful mask. I mean, there's not much to say about it. Now... Halloween 4 mask. I adore this mask. It is actually so good in my opinion. I love it. I adore it. So, this is top 3, I believe. So, we've got... Halloween 6, Halloween 2018, and the original. Coming in third place, Halloween 6, The Curse of Michael Myers Mask. Pretty good. Pretty daggum good. I wish to one day get the Trick or Treat Studios um, one of this. Wait a minute. No, no, no. Did I say top three? Second? Hmm. This is the fourth. Um, mask. So, Halloween 6. Third. Halloween Resurrection. Stop with the tomatoes. Let me just tell you why. <clears throat> Halloween Re Resurrection was the first Halloween I ever saw. I was like six years old. And I actually quite liked it, but I was still terrified by it. But it was so good. Um, 
Also, I wish to get the Trick or Street Studios mask of that. Second place. This is going to be a controversial pick. Halloween 1978. This is the most iconic mask in, like, mask history. Guys, they took a William Shatner Star Trek Captain Kirk mask, painted it fish belly white, cut out the eyes, dyed the hair brown, and messed up the hair. It cost them back then like two dollars to make that mask. So, revolutionary for its time. Finally, coming in first place, the best Michael Myers mask ever, in my opinion. Halloween 2018. James Jude Courtney mask. But this is the definition of a good mask. So, yeah, I think that's gonna end my ranking. So, bye guys. Peace. Love you.